Greetings one and all, how's everyone doing? I hope well. Gonna be doing the, gonna be doing an at home review of the Quasar down sleeping bag, mummy bag. Now I do owe Quasar an apology because they, they rushed it out to me. Um, cause I told them, oh great, I basically got the email like on Monday and I said, oh good, interesting timing because I'm actually going, I was planning on going camping this weekend. And then my buddy had a loss in his family which I'm not gonna go over because you know it's, it's his business, not my business. So, which is sad. And then we had burn downs on top of it, so it's a it's a double kick in the bollocks. So as much as I wanted to go out and do stuff, it's like, uh, you know, can I camp without a a fire? Yeah. Would it be as fun? No. So let's open up the bag and because I haven't even got it out of the bag yet, so let's get it out of the bag. And then um, we'll go over all the stats and stuff. And so at least you guys can get the info on the bag. So I'm just doing this on my bed. So it's a compression sack, as you can see. So you can crush this thing down. I'll loosen up the straps. Oh, that one slipped right out. I'll have to fix that. I always try not to get them, uh, have it too. Uh, one of these is a uh, removable, but the other two are not. That's interesting. So, get this guy out. There should be a drawstring right here, which is tucked down inside. I think it's, I think it's tied. So, oh, there's a, comes as a mesh bag as well. It's probably for storage once you get it home. That's a nice touch. Because it's being a down bag, you don't want to have it compressed while you're, you know, Compress all the time because it'll flatten out the down and it will ruin your bag. So, nice foot box. You gotta wait for the down to kind of fluff up. Which, you know, it's funny how they can be stored in the bag when you get it or, you know, in the store and whatnot. But when you bring it home and store it, you got a zipper enclosure here on the top. I'll open this sucker up. So, I like the color inside. It's a nice color. They have uh, multiple color um, differences too. On their, on the, there's an Amazon store and also there's a um, their website as well. So let's uh, go over some stats here while this thing right. kind of fluffs so, up. As I drop the notepad. Excuse the glasses, I'm getting old, so a little harder to read. Uh, even though I wrote it. Which if I was thinking about it, I could have wrote it bigger. So the length is... Uh, so I'm reading and I look away and I'm like... Anyway, uh, the length is uh, 84.6 inches so that's seven feet five inches so and i'm uh five eleven because you shrink as you age don't know why wow can i hang on to anything today hang up so seven feet long 31.5 wide that's two point uh, two point six two five inches wide this might be a little bit of an issue for me because, you know, I got uh, Mr. Stomach here. But, like I said, I'd hope to get this thing out and sleep in it. 3.2 pounds, so not too heavy. It's actually not a bad weight at all. I actually, this is this will actually be the first down sleeping bag I actually owned. Um, the Amazon reviews, I just took a look at them and uh, 53% we're all five star reviews, so people liked it. I mean, you gotta kind of take those reviews for the grain of salt because 
I read some reviews where it's like one of the one star reviews was I got the wrong sleeping bag. Well, that's not a knock on a product. You just got the wrong bag. I mean, no one is perfect. Mistakes happen. 39% were four star reviews and 11% were only three star reviews. So pretty good reviews. Uh, 600 PF. I think that's fill weight. But it says 1,000 grams. So I'm not sure if that's the duck feather weight or what that means. Sorry, I guess I'm not as... Uh, knowledgeable about sleeping bags as I thought I was, but uh, yeah, so far it's looking like a decent bag and I, I wish I was out doing an overnighter with it because I had a tarp shelter set up all planned for it. And from the looks of it, I think it, I think it, it would fit me all right. It's a good looking bag and I like the colors. Got a nice uh, drawstring up here towards your head so when your your head is up here in the box, you got your pillow in here, which I always bring a pillow. You can cinch it up so it doesn't move around. Fluffing up real nice. I like that it comes with an extra bag, a mesh bag, big mesh bag for uh, probably storage. I, I like that a lot. I think that's a great feature. I didn't get a mesh bag with my um, my mom's current mummy bag. So plus the compression sack. Oh, I forgot to tell you the price. Uh, uh, I think I found so Amazon I wasn't quite sure because they had different prices but one of the Amazon prices was uh, $149.99 but on their website it was $111.99 so it might save money by going to their website and buying it direct from their site <coughs> excuse me um, yeah buy direct from their website instead of buying it on Amazon unless you're an Amazon Prime member, and you can take advantage of free shipping like I do. So, um, depending on how much they charge for shipping on the website, you can go to Amazon if you're a Prime member and see if it's, uh, you know, see if the price evens out. So, it might be something to think about. I know sometimes Amazon, while I'm buying, it'll say, You want to become a Prime member for a trial basis, like I mentioned before? I say, Sure, I'll take the trial. Wait a week and then cancel the trial and don't have to pay anything, but you got free shipping, so might be something to take advantage of. So, like I said, I wish I was uh, doing a little bit more with this, but you know, it is what it is, I guess. Hopefully, ben, burn bands will lighten up and then um, I can start getting out like I want or get out again for an overnighter. I'm a little bit depressed, bummed by that, but. I mean, what are you gonna do, right? So, all right. Well, that is the. Did I go over everything? Check my notes. Make sure I give you all the info. Of course, all the links will be in the description, and everything else will be down below. So you can go and take a look for yourself. Read up on it. Um, yeah, I got the prices, the length, the weight, different. Uh, uh the higher. Um. Temperature ratings, I think, are going to have different weights, so something to look at. Yeah, I think I went over everything. So, I want to get this in the woods. So, you'll probably be seeing it in the woods, and I definitely want to get it in a hammock, too. Because I can just use it like a quilt in my hammock. And I also, I had a plan, whole plan for a, um, 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 wow, brain fart. Oh, uh, like I said, a tarp shelter. So... Yeah, there you go. All right, well, there's the Qu uh, Quasar sleeping bag, mummy bag. Uh, this one is down. And then I really want to get out of it and see how it does, but, you know, I gotta, I'm gotta. i actually not going to get a day off this week because I have to uh, have to work. So, it's a real bummer, but, I mean, what are you going to do? Unless someone has a get-rich-quick scheme, I can, you know, somehow win the lottery and, all my money, troubles with money will be over, but until then. Um, or or maybe the burn bands can lift and I can slip out for an overnighter, which would be nice. Or something. But anyway, I do thank you for watching, so I'll quit rambling. I will uh, catch you on the uh, next one. Uh, description will have a bunch of links, and I'll try to put them in the end as well. Uh, just so you can go check them out. And uh, as always, have a good one, and we'll catch you on the next one.